as Jesus' ministry on earth came to an end, he knew that he would be put to death. He and his disciples went to the garden to pray, Lord, take this cup from me. As Jesus and his disciples were in the garden, Judas came with some Roman guards to arrest Jesus. Judas was one of the disciples, but he betrayed Jesus. This is Jesus. Peter tried to defend Jesus, but Jesus told him this was supposed to happen. Stop! The guards took Jesus, and he would be put on trial. Even though they could find nothing wrong with Jesus, they wanted him to be put to death. I have only spoken truth. You will pay for your crimes. The Jews decided to have Jesus beaten and crucified. They placed a crown of thorns on his head and made him carry his cross. Keep moving! Jesus was crucified beside two other men. When he died on the cross, he took on the sins of the world so that we could be forgiven. After hours of hanging on the cross, he took his final breath. It is finished. Jesus' body was placed in a tomb and guarded by Romans. On the third day, Mary Magdalene and Mary, mother of Jesus, went to visit Jesus' tomb. When they got there, they were shocked. The stone was rolled away, and Jesus was gone. Jesus had risen. He conquered the grave, and he is still alive today. We can choose to follow him, the way, the truth, and the life.